The MA in Terrorism, Security and Society is an incredibly unique program because it's grounded in academic theory, but we encourage our students to apply that theory to the world of counter-terror practice and counter-terror policy as often as possible. I would most definitely do this program again. The professors here were very helpful and insightful. I have a whole new outlook on terrorism and counterterrorism, the tools I've learned, the foundational theories. I'm half American, half Norwegian. I uh, grew up both in the US and in Norway. And after 9-11, being an American abroad, I was more aware of the security issues. So then I started reading more into terrorism and wanted to do terrorism in my studies. The the terrorism program is obviously focused very much on terrorism and everything to do with terrorism. We're looking at different conflicts around the world in which terrorism has played a role, but we're also looking at how it feeds back into Western countries. I used to be studying mathematics in Imperial, uh, which is a very scientific and very empirical based kind of studies. So I don't have a lot of interactions with professors other than during the period I was doing a research. But while here, um, being a master's student, uh, we are allowed, or I mean, we are encouraged to participate in a lot of public events and public time, public lectures, but actually diversify my, my mentality and as well as my thinking process. Oh, we are 36 students and we come from very different backgrounds, whether it be literature or sciences or terrorism as I come from. Um, and it's very interesting because we have different political ideas. Uh, my personal tutor as well as my dissertation advisor was Professor Brooke Rogers. She was there for me if I had any personal questions, any issues with my classes. She also helped me with my dissertation and getting ethical approval and all around she's gone um, above and beyond for our students. Well, because it's a small class, you really do have time with the professors. Um, they like to come to social events and actually get to know their students. We also encourage students to become very much involved outside of the classroom. So we do always forward and facilitate internships, for example. I'm running a center which studies radicalization and political violence. We are always involving students from the course, and that gives them an opportunity to explore things in practice. We attract an amazingly diverse range of students to the course, which creates a really interesting environment within the classroom. For example, we draw students from some of the more traditional war studies areas, such as um, international policy and international relations and history, and they get to engage and mix with students who are coming from less traditional war studies areas, such as psychology and engineering and um, anthropology and classics. After I graduated, I had a job lined up in Pakistan with a news channel. Um, it was Tamar TV news channel, so I was going to be working on a prime time talk show. Um, and I was going to be looking at political events and current affairs within Pakistan, focusing primarily on the war on terror. Um, so it was, a, it was a good transition from my master's to apply for what I had learned back to the political talk show in Pakistan. I'm currently subcontracting for a global risk management company. I work in intelligence and analysis and I've been focusing on South Asia specifically, um, political, focusing on political risk analysis, um, civil unrest um, for our clients. What's very important about war studies and about this master's course is of course that war studies is a hub of ideas. Almost every day there are events at the department and it is so important when you want to go on and to have a great, to have a great career to meet people and to be able to interact with people that are important in the field. And doing the masters at King's gives you precisely that opportunity because there are so many speakers, so many panel discussions, so many people coming through the department that you can meet and greet and perhaps even uh, start to work with.